and I'm happy to be in the archives of Falahli with all the trophies on what's happening uh, in Cairo. And I must respect the coach that is there, but I know Al-Ahli is complex, it's a, it's a complex club. you at Al Ahli. We're seen kissing the badge, but things are not going too well there and the fans are calling your name at games, they want you back. Is there any chance of you potentially going back to the club as one of possibly a few clubs that can afford you? Uh, I don't like the afford part. <laughs> <laughs> I like the football part. You know, I, I think the football uh, will affect the, the, the financial part. So you must do the right job first. Where Alakli was with international tournaments, where Alakli was with the local tournaments. With the local tournaments, Alakli is always strong. They've been winning the league when I came over there. I finished the league that was already won, to be honest. But I'm happy to be part of that, you know, because also, when we when we handed over the trophy and the medals and whatever, now I, I must sit there on the side when I've done the last seven games. So I, I had to, to be part of the team, and it would sound bad if if I really sit on the side. But um, look, we have won a lot of things, and I'm happy to be in the archives of Falahli with all the trophies, all the trophies that we have been, we have done, and and a repetition and repetitions, also. What's happening uh, in Cairo? Um, it's not my space, and I must respect the coach that is there. He's there, and uh, he's a European coach. You come from pro license, you those things. You know the story. And uh, he has done his work in Portugal. I think he's a good coach. You won't be able to coach Alakli when you're not good. But I know Alakli is complex. It's a it's a complex club, and African clubs are complex. To, to the European coaches because 